Check out MMOGO if you're looking to buy cheap, reliable NBA Live mobile coins. Click the link in the description and use the code BOBBY for 5% off. What's up, ballers? We are here with a huge round of two elite player pack opening. We've also got some round of one players that we're going to be opening as well. So since this is an elite pack opening, it's this video is probably going to get a lot of views. And there are probably a lot of people out there watching that have not subscribed to my channel yet. So if that's you, first, I want to thank you for joining. Second, I want to ask you to do me a huge favor and hit the subscribe button down below. I would really appreciate that. Even if you don't stay subscribed, even if you just subscribe for, say, three days, I think you guys will realize that this is definitely a channel that's going to help you out with NBA Live Mobile. Hopefully, the other guys out there will vouch for me down in the comments. I'm pretty much always the first person to upload whenever there's new content. As is proof by this video, it is 8.33 in the morning and I am currently working on my third video of the day. So uh, anyways, we are going to jump into some pack openings. So we're going to go ahead and blast through some of these first round player packs real quick. Just to uh, get some of those out of the way, I actually had them stacked up for a variety pack opening. And now realizing that we're going to need them for the 91 plus sets for the second round players. So we're gonna go ahead and open those up and then get to the second round packs, which is what I'm excited about and I'm sure that you guys are excited about as well. So probably not gonna get a whole lot out of these, at least not anything surprising. We've pretty much opened a ton of these and pretty much know what's in every single one of them. So the prices on elites have gone up a little bit, obviously because of the new sets. That was to be expected, but I have plenty uh, that I need right now in order to open up these new 91 plus sets. So hopefully that shouldn't be too much of an issue. I might have to cut it out in the middle of the video and then cut back in if I need to buy some more players. But I'm not too worried about that. So we do have a couple 90 plus round one players as well that I had just sitting around. So we'll get open up those as well. Not really going to have any surprise in here. All right, Draymond Green, 92 overall. Really anything 90, I guess 92 and better is helpful. Um, obviously, we knew Draymond Green. Ooh, all right, back-to-back -back Draymonds. Um, really, the higher the overall, the better. So I'm not going to complain about that. And we get a Giannis right there. So looking pretty good so far. Here we go with the semifinal players. Ooh, all right, so Rodney Hood got upgraded. Uh, we actually just pulled a couple of his cards earlier. Got some solid stats right there. He is an 89 overall. Not going to be super useful in the sets. The most useful ones will be the 91 pluses. Trevor Ariza right there. All right. I imagine he's probably one of the lower overalls. I imagine the lowest is probably 86 or 87. All right. Another Trevor Ariza. Was not expecting that. Fortunately, we've got lots of these packs, so hopefully we can get something solid out of the regular player packs. Ooh, Nene. I think he is the lowest overall in the packs right now. Seems like they have a lot of Rockets players that are getting cars. All right, lots of Arizas and lots of Nene's. Hopefully we can get some variety going in here. All right, Patty Mills, that Bruh. is, ugh. What's wrong with his hair? It looks so bad. Oh, goodness gracious. That is out. For an 86, this is actually a really good card. 93 dribbling, 90 speed, 86 three-pointer, 81 passing. Aside from like the ugliness of the card, that's a pretty solid card. And here we go with our last Western Conference player. All right, lots and lots of Rockets players. Not really what I was looking for. Hopefully we get better luck in the East. Norman Powell, I actually, I didn't call this one, but I should have called it because I knew that he had been playing really well recently. 96 speed that is ridiculous i did not know that he was that fast wow that is crazy 89 dribbling too he's got uh, 80 shooting i believe that said so we will finish up these eastern and western conference elite players all right we get another one and then we'll go and open up some of those 90 plus players with what we have already avery bradley he's been playing some phenomenal defense for the celtics right now haven't seen a whole lot of variety out of these packs. I'm not sure that they added too many more players because it seems like 
Uh, no matter how many I open, we're kind of getting the same players over and over again. All right, we get a Tristan Thompson right there. 89 defense really is only standout stat. Hopefully we get a little bit of variety, maybe a 91 plus. Ooh, Al Horford. All right, so we're getting upgraded a little bit. 83 shooting, 83 defense. That looks like a pretty solid card. And our last one, hopefully something good. All right, Avery Bradley. Seen him plenty of times already. We're gonna head down to the 90 plus set and see what we can get. So we're gonna throw in a couple Nene's, couple Ennis Canthers, and see what this will give us. I don't know what our options are, so I'm gonna be as surprised as you guys. Here we go with our first one. Three, two, one. All right, Rudy Gobert. Why did he get a 91 plus? He was, he literally had zero impact on the entire Jazz series. He was either injured or fouled out for like the entire series. That is, that's so funny. I can't believe they did that. Um, yeah. <laughs> All right, that's a, that's a little bit surprising to me. I'm not complaining about it. I just don't really understand why they would give him that card. Uh, here we go with the next one. Please, not a Rudy Gobert. Bruh. All right, another Rudy Gobert. Solid. Thank you very much, NBA Live Mobile. I do not appreciate that. Here we go with our next one. Please give me some variety. Come on. Bruh. Oh my goodness, another Rudy Gobert. All right, do we have enough to open one more? <sighs> Dang it. I might have to go, let's see. I might need to open one more elite second round player for the West. I think I have enough gold players. Yes, I do. We'll throw Rodney Hood in there and that should give us what we need to open one more of those 91 plus players that hideous, <laughs> oh my goodness. I am so sorry to Patty Mills. He What's wrong with his hair? I don't know, maybe it's just that picture. Maybe I'm seeing it wrong. All right, here we go. Our last Western semifinals player. Please not Rudy Gobert. Oh my goodness. <laughs> Zero variety in these packs right now. All right, hopefully we can switch it up a little bit in the Eastern Conference packs because we have zero variety in the West. Come on, give me something. All right, DeMar DeRozan, he's got a, ooh, 89 shooting, 86 speed, 87 dribbling, 82 passing. That's a solid card, I'll take that. I'm really hoping we're not just getting like the same card over and over again like we did for the West. Come on, East, be kind to me. Give me a little bit of variety right here. Did we only get like one new player for the 91 pluses? This is this is a little bit disappointing right now. Uh, another repeat, hopefully we've got what we need. Yep, we do. This might be the last option that we have. No, I think we can open one more 91 plus player for the East after this one. Come on. Oh, oh that is a nice card. 94 Kyrie Irving. 97 dribbling, 91 speed, 88 three-pointer. Oh my gosh, that's a beautiful card. I might have to do some gameplay with him. If I did gameplay with him today, that would probably be like a, I would have like five uploads today, so I might save him for tomorrow, but that is a nice card. I will take that. Thank you, NBA Live Mobile. It's about time. All right, give me another one of those Kyries. Ooh, Bradley Beal. I actually predicted that he was going to get the uh, MasterCard for the East because uh, one of the developers said that the MasterCards was going to be one shooting guard and one point guard, and for some reason they had James Harden as a shooting guard. So that was the reason for my confusion on that, but that is a nice card. 87 shooting, 87 three-pointer, 91 dribbling, 84 speed, 84 passing, another really solid card. Now I want to open more Eastern Conference players but I don't want to throw another DeRozan in there. Let's see, I don't think we have enough players. We might, now I kind of want to go back and open. Yeah, I don't have enough Western Conference players anyway, so that's probably going to be about it for this episode. If you guys got anything better than that out of these packs, let me know. I didn't even know that they went up to a 94. I guess I should have expected that since the highest for the first round was 93. But uh, yeah, I'm pretty happy with that Kyrie Irving pull. Let me know if you guys want to see some gameplay with that, but that's going to be about it for this episode. Uh, thank you to all of you guys who did subscribe earlier on the video. I really appreciate that. 
And that's going to be about it. So make sure you like and comment which players you got from these packs. And I will see you guys next time.